Hello friends and fans of EVGA and today we're going to give you a quick video that shows you how to install the vBIOS updates that we sometimes put on our forums. Uh, occasionally when we release products we will do uh, minor firmware updates to them particularly on graphics cards if we want to add additional features. Uh, with the launch of the new RTX cards we have an update on uh, most of the models that we currently have out and that allows for a higher power target in case you're trying to overclock your graphics card. So if we go here to our forums we have a post here from Jacob this has the instructions and also what the actual BIOS update does um, this particular car that we have is a 2080 XC Ultra and we specify download here for that file we'll save that file open it up in our Windows Explorer you want to extract that file and then very simple, there's an update file. I'm gonna right click and then run as administrator on that. Um, you'll notice that a command prompt window comes up here and it's all automatic. So um, you may see the screen blackout. Um, you may see the resolution change. There we go. So the resolution's gone down a little bit. That means that we've disabled the current vBIOS on the card that allows us to flash the new one. Go ahead and press Y for yes. And it'll go through the process automatically and flash the card. Okay, and there we go, we're done. Any key to exit. Uh, usually we'll give you some information as far as what the BIOS version is if you want to check and say GPU Z to make sure the, the update went through successfully, but 99% of the time it'll work just fine first time uh, and no issues. So that's just a quick and easy guide on how you can flash your card if we put an, a BIOS update out on the EVGA forums. Alright, <clears throat> everything's recording? Yes, except you need to clap. 